Today we're going to talk about how to choose which brush is best for your pet. We have two types of brushes. We have our slicker brushes, and then we also have our pin brushes. And while we're choosing which type is best, the thing, one important thing to remember is you never want to brush a coat that's dry. So we always recommend using our healthy coat hydrating leave-in conditioner spray, and you always want to just lightly mist the coat. That provides some extra moisture and will help the coat from breaking as well. Choosing the slicker brush is a great choice for dogs that have curly coats. It's great to separate and divide the coat and just lightly mist again using the healthy coat moisturizing conditioning spray. And then you lightly brush through the dog, separating and dividing the coat. This is good to use before you go to comb the coat and then before you do final prepping on the coat with scissoring and clipping. So this brush I like because it fits nicely in your hand, but it also, the bristles aren't real strong, so they're not going to scratch your skin. One thing I always recommend in order to make sure that you're not hurting the dog and to keep the dog nice and comfortable and relaxed is to first brush your arm so you feel how that feels on your skin and then continue to use that same amount of pressure and same motion when you're brushing your pet. And again, this is a great choice to use for curly coated dogs and other breeds for separating and dividing the coat and lifting it off the skin. And the other type of brush to use is our pin brushes. And again, these are nice, they fit nicely in your hand, they have nice balance. Um, and then again, it's good for lifting the coat here. It's good to use around on the head area on curly coated dogs. You can also use it on the tail. And if you're using it on another area, again, make sure that you're gonna lightly mist the coat. And so you see how I spray this up and then I let that mist fall down to the coat. And again, it's good for separating and dividing on longer pieces of hair. A great brush to choose for using with drop coats. And again, it helps lift the coat, it separates the coat, and it's the first step before you start to comb the coat.